Hello, this is Kilo Kilo 4, Mike November Delta, David in Clearwater, Florida. And I'm getting ready to film for you guys a uh, Saudi Sat SO50 uh, passing over. And I'm going to try it this time instead of using the MFJ 1717S dual band antenna, which is, it works, just not quite as well as this Cubix dual band antenna. So, so I'm using ProSat here on my iPad too to track the satellite pass um, as you can see here or maybe not in the video <laughs> uh, Saudi sets uh, just coming in range 29 degrees elevation and coming from our southwest we we'll be heading over to northeast so gonna tune up Echo Mike 29, Kilo Kilo 4, Mike November Delta is Echo Lima 88, Echo Lima 88. Kilo Kilo 4, Mike November Delta, November 8, Romeo Oscar, Echo Mike 00. November 8, Romeo Oscar, November 8, Romeo Oscar, this is David Kilo Kilo 4, Mike November Delta, handheld. Uh, Echo Lima 88, Florida, and I uh, have you on my YouTube video, KK4MND. Okay, Roger, Roger, KSL. Thanks so much for the contact. Have a great evening. 73, 73, 73. 6 Charlie Bravo, Kilo Kilo 4, Mike November Delta. Good evening, Hector. Good evening, Hector. Kilo Kilo 4, Mike November Delta, Echo Lima 88. Uh, have you Lima Charlie, and I have you on YouTube as well, KK4MND. Okay, Echo Lima 88, Echo Lima 88. This is Kilo Kilo 4, Mike November Delta, and that's how it works when you use a real antenna. It's a Cubix um, dual band antenna. And uh, just to clarify some things, I am not using it in dual band mode. I don't, do not have the duplexer installed. I'm using the two meter side, uh, using the two meter side, BNC connector, uh, straight to the radio. Uh, I'm looking for a duplexer, but it seems like this Cubix works excellent um, on just a single band antenna. So. Kilo Kilo 4, Mike November Delta, David in Clearwater, signing off, 73s.